Local community leader is taking legal action after he says LA County Sheriff's deputies entered his home in the middle of the night and detained him at gunpoint by mistake. Derek Cooper says he feared for his life during the encounter. Cooper and his attorneys held a news conference this afternoon saying they believe his rights were violated and they plan to sue the county. KHLA 5 Sandra Mitchell joins us live at the Sheriff's Department at the headquarters there in downtown LA with more on this. Hi Sandra. Hi, Court. Yeah, not just detained. Derek Cooper tells us he was forced out into the streets half naked, and he says he feels like he was humiliated and his rights were violated. In a moment, you're going to hear the response from the L.A. County Sheriff's Department. But first, Cooper's side of the story. I am not perfect, but I don't deserve this. An angry, emotional Derek Cooper detailing what he calls his unlawful detainment by L.A. County Sheriff's deputies literally pleaded with them. I am unarmed. Please do not shoot me. I will comply. Cooper shared this video of three deputies entering his Compton home just after 4 a.m. Tuesday, waking him up with guns pointed right at him. Cooper, a longtime community leader who's worked with children through his youth academy, says he was forced to exit his home naked from the waist down. Can I at least put on some underwear or a towel or something to cover myself? They said no. At a news conference this afternoon. They paraded him out on this public street, walked him from this door. His attorney said there were no warrants or complaints against Cooper. They believe deputies had the wrong address, and Cooper's legal team announced the first step of a lawsuit against the sheriff's department. This is unacceptable behavior. You will pay for this. We do expect penalties and punishments. The intentional infliction of emotional distress the emotional and psychological distress and trauma that is suffered by Mr. Cooper is something that will be addressed in court. Cooper says he was forced to sit naked in the back of a patrol car for 20 minutes before deputies apologized and let him go. When I got out that car, I felt like a runaway slave and this is no drama because I wanted to get to a place where I was safe. A crying Cooper now says he is so fearful for his life, he will take his family out of LA. You hear so many times when these police officers go into these dwellings, these apartments, these homes, and they shoot first, and then questions are asked later. I did not want to be one of those statistics. I did reach out to the LA County Sheriff's Department today. They responded with an email saying they were in the area investigating a burglary and that once they determined Mr. Cooper was not a suspect, they released him. But they went on to say they're still investigating. We're live in downtown LA. I'm Sandra Mitchell, KTLA 5 News. Court and Sam, back to you.